out on her <clears throat> regular walk here. I've got both dogs on easy walk harnesses. Um, her leash walking is way better than his. He, uh, he's quite pulley on leash, but uh, she's obviously just had more practice. Uh, I find that on her own, she's not even on alert. Like she's, she's looking around, but she's got her ears not at full mass there. Listening and walking pretty nicely. And she seems quite relaxed. She's much more alert when she's with him because just because he's more anxious about everything. So when we come up to the end of the street here, there's usually dogs behind the fence. What I've also been doing at home is just playing dog barking sounds. And I was doing it, I played them for a while one time and she actually got quite scared and tried to go in a different room. So I think that she's actually pretty scared of other strange dogs. So becoming friends with more new dogs. So if you have friends with dogs, you can walk her with or some neighborhood dogs that she can meet through a chain link fence like right here so there's a couple of dogs in here usually and if they're relatively friendly then a lot of the time you can just go up and she doesn't have to sniff them right away but she can just go and kind of sniff them from a distance and you just stand around until they both relax I think she just needs to make some dog friends and just build up her confidence in, in greeting new dogs. Because I found her just quite fearful. Oh, that? Is that a dog? Is that a dog? Oh, it's chickens. Oh, it's chickens. Oh, someone's got a backyard. And that's definitely where your reactivity is coming from, is that she's a bit scared, so she puts on a big guard dog front and makes a big scene. Oh, no, 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 no,